From the longtime home of the Royals, we welcome you to Kauffman Stadium in Kansas City. His name is Lyle Overbay. Well, here's a guy that really doesn't hit a lot of home runs for a first baseman, but he did lead the National League in doubles a few years ago, so he knows what he's doing up there. Hit hard to short. Oh, what a stop by Pena. Throw gets him at first base as he took away a sure base hit that time. Well, he takes away a hit here. Have a look at this. He's got to stretch out to get the thing and then pop into throwing position to get his man at first. Greg Zahn, ready to go here. Now a swing and a ground ball. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. Well, you got that right. This is a long throw, and he puts a lot into it and gets it there just in time. Ritzelonic will stand. Swing and a ball bounced back up the middle. Oh, look at McDonald. Ah, but the throw will be well late. One nearly got him. Here's a swing and a ground ball. And he's safe at first. Two men gone. Hit hard to the left side. And that's in there. Base hit. And the runner will score from second. The Royals are on top. One to nothing. McDonald will dig in. It's this one. This should be strike two. And this is on the ground toward the hole. And a low throw that time, but good footwork there by Butler as he's able to hang with it, and the inning is over. A one to nothing score. Now a hard hit ball back up the middle, and that's past the diving infielder for a base hit. Billy Butler will step in. Two. And he leans into a curveball there as it's hit high and deep out to left field. And out of here! It's a two-run shot to straight away left, and the Royals have moved out to a three-to-nothing lead. Flash you back to the middle innings here. This was a big blow, a two-run home run that really got his guys going. Royals out in front, three to nothing. Well, you'll get a look at his line right there, and you can see he's off to a very strong start. Five and a third innings, just a couple of hits allowed. Balls his last time. Runners on the move for second. In the dirt, might not be enough to try it. And no throw, as it turns out, as he takes second with ease. Now a ball hit back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And that'll put him on the board as it's now a 3-1 to one contest. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man. We're in the eighth from Kauffman Stadium. On the ground to second base. This could be two. Pena for one. On to Butler, but it's too late, and they'll just take the one. And 0 for 3 thus far. Swing and a bullet to the right side. In there, a base hit. Now a swing and a bouncing ball toward the hole. A dive, but it's off his glove. And no chance on the throw here as he reaches first. In so far, they need a big hit here. And this is swung on and pretty well hit. Out to deep left center field. Tian is there as he makes the catch, and they'll tightrope out of danger as he strands the bases loaded. Blue Jays strand three. Swing and a high chopper. Throw will be well late as he reaches it first. They just haven't been able to string anything together so far. Struck him out, but he'll try for first on the drop third strike. And they will put the tag on him. They got him, and with that, the ball game is over. Always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond the call of duty here in this one. So that brings us to the conclusion of this one.